Hello, I'm Jeffrey Uzongo. Here's your Channel's TV Evening News Recap for July the 23rd, 2019. President Mohamed Buhari has submitted a list of ministerial nominees to the Senate for confirmation. Some of the 43 names of the list are Godswill Akpabio, Festus Kayamo, Ralph Arekbeshala, Niyi Adebayo, Bemisola Saraki, Sharon Ikiazo, Ikechuku Oga, Mohamed Bello, Adamo Adamu, Mariam Katagum, Timi Pri Silva, and George Akume. Still in the nation's capital, the president has condoled with the management and staff of Channels TV over the death of Precious Owolabi, a core member who was serving with the station. He also commiserated with the family of the deceased as well as the police leadership over the death of the Deputy Commissioner of Police, Usman Uma. Both Owolabi and Uma died from gunshot injuries sustained during the clash between members of the Islamic movement in Nigeria and the police. Meanwhile, the chairman of Channels Media Group, Mr. John Momo, has also condoled with the family of Precious of Wallaby. Speaking during his visit to the headquarters of the police in Abuja, Mr. Momo adds that an investigation be opened into the case. He said it is extremely important that the culprit is brought to book, adding that it will help bring closure to all those concerned. On the international scene, Boris Johnson has won the race to become Britain's next Prime Minister on Tuesday, but will face a confrontation over Brexit with Brussels and members of his own party, as well as a tense diplomatic standoff with Iran. The former London mayor easily beat his rival, Foreign Secretary Jeremy Hunt, in the poll conducted among members of the governing Conservative Party. And in sports, goal from Tammy Abraham and Rose Barkley saw Chelsea grab a 2-1 victory against Barcelona on Tuesday in an exhibition match in Japan. Chelsea striker Abraham opened the scoring in the 34th minute by pouncing a mistake by Barcelona midfielder Sergio Bosket, who attempted to clear the ball. And that's the evening news recap. Don't forget to join us tomorrow for a fresh update. I'm Jeffrey Ozama. Thank you for watching.